We're in Nashville! Woo! We just made it to our room in Nashville, and there's an envelope for us. Daniel and Stephanie. Must be that VIP treatment or something. <laughs> Yo, hear that? Let's see what it says. Do you want to open it? Yeah, let's see here. Oh, say what? Oh my gosh, a gift for you. Elevate your gold experience. Happy anniversary <gasps> with $25 to Up and Rooftop Lounge. Check, Check your, your fridge. fridge. What? what? Let's see here. Where's the fridge? Where's I, the, if, I the, was, if I was a fridge, uh, is there going to be a bottle of bubbly or what? Here we go. Oh what my the gosh. What is this? It's a charcuterie board. I love that charcuterie boards. That is amazing. That is so cute. We've never had anything like this. We haven't. No. That is awesome. That is so awesome. Should I get this out? Or we'll get settled first and, and then, then we'll, we'll bust it out. Yeah. That is awesome. Thank you, Up Rooftop Lounge. That is amazing. So cute. I'm so excited. And look, it expires. Not Apple. <laughs> this is good for life right here. <laughs> that is awesome. You. What did I say? Is... There was right. another note that we missed. So another, another note. So, hello, congratulations on your anniversary. It's fitting that you're staying with us. No one appreciates beards and love more than we do. Enjoy. That is phenomenal. Fairfield Marriott. <laughs> no way. That's awesome. I have to take a picture of this. <laughs> We're in Nashville. Woo Last year, I told Daniel, I go, let's go to Nashville, and, like make an annual trip to Nashville every single year. And he was like, no way. And then here we are, less than a year later, back in Nashville. I really like the size of this camera right now. Yeah, so this whole trip, I'm vlogging on the Lumix G100. It is a perfect size, it's so lightweight, and has a remote control handle, so I can either take a photo or um, start and stop recording from the handle, like with my thumb. So convenient. Absolutely love it. So we just found these really cool murals, so we were just taking photos. But this one, holy shit, Nashville, damn good to see you. Very accurate, because now we're in my favorite city. And then we have, when life gives you balls, play with them. All right, so we just got done shopping. I got a ton of cute stuff. And now we just stop for a juice and an awesome bowl. That clean juice, and then we just got like the hardcore one. Oh, see right there. Am I allowed to eat? Yes, you can oh. eat now. I got my photo. Look how handsome that guy looks. Oh, stop it. <laughs> That's the whiskey talking. We haven't had any alcohol yet. True. All right, so we went shopping, walked around the Gulch, and then took a cat nap. It was much needed. Um, we were exhausted. And now we're gonna head up to Up Rooftop, which is at the hotel we're staying at here in Nashville. And they're the ones who gave us like a little greeting card and charcuterie board when we arrived for our anniversary, which was so sweet. So we're gonna go up, have some dinner and some drinks, and then we'll see where the night takes us. However, it won't take us out late because Nashville's curfew is 10 p.m. So we're going to see how much we can get done before 10 o'clock tonight. <laughs> and then we just got our drinks. Drinks. Cheers. Cheers. Well, first they told us to pace ourselves because we were going pretty deep <laughs> with all the food. And then they brought us out this little cheesecake. So cute. All right, so we just went on a little after dinner walk from being at the Up Rooftop Lounge um, in the Gulch. We decided to do a little walk down to Broadway. She decided down. to. Yeah. All her ideas. I like the lights. It's fun. Even though 
we walk down there after 10 and like everything shuts down at 10 due to like COVID and everything in the phase that Nashville's in right now. Cops are out in full force enforcing actual face masks. Like they're citing people for not wearing their face masks. Yeah, as soon as we stepped on Broadway, these guys are like, dude, wear your mask, they're citing people. And literally 10 steps in, people are getting cited for not wearing the mask. So we had our masks on and then walked a little bit, got off Broadway, walking back to our hotel. And then we decided after our little, we were done with our after dinner walk, we were gonna do the scooters. We decided to get the bird scooters right back to our hotel. And they're on curfew too and they're sleeping until 6 a.m. So now we're full on walking back to our hotel. The scooter's down the hill. And it hurts to try. I really hope there's some live music. Obviously there was like a ton of people on Broadway. So like there are uh, places still open, but I just want to dance with Daniel. I love dancing with him and any chance I can get to dance with him, I'm gonna take it. Girl, you would be dancing by yourself. She doesn't want to, she, she's just saying that to be nice as far as she likes to dance with me. She dances by herself all the time. Yeah, but it is nice to dance with my boyfriend. True. All right, I think we're gonna log off for tonight, make our plan for tomorrow. Tomorrow we have reservations at White Limousine on top of the Graduate, which just opens, all pink. Dolly Parton, Dolly Parton, wait, was it? Dolly Parton? Dolly Parton, sorry, that was, I'm one drink deep and it was really strong. Um, and so yeah, I will catch you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning, so we got a little late start today. Um, and now we've just been walking around Hillsboro Village. Okay, this is crazy. We had a late start, but it wasn't really due to her. It was more so due to me, but last oh. night she got super toasty. Off so one drink. It's, it's very impressive drink. that she actually was the first one up. But I mean, this is her yeah. town. I'm excited. She's like, we're here. getting up at 7 a.m. every single morning and, and we we're haven't. doing stuff. Because every time we go to a place that he wants to go to, we get up super early. It's different though. Yeah, because it's what you want to do. No, there's so, different things that we're doing. We walked around Hillsborough Village, we got some coffee, did some shopping, wore my new shirt I got eat last night while we were shopping. So now we're gonna go back to the room. I'm gonna change outfits for our um, reservation at White Limousine. But that's annoying, that honking. But what I love about this camera is that the microphone like changes to your environment, or like not the microphone, the microphone in the camera changes to your environment. It's selective, it like tracks where the audio is. So if you're if you're vlogging like this, the mics in the front engage, whereas if the camera was turned around and you were talking about what the camera is looking at, it picks you up from behind. Mm -hmm. Super cool how it does that. So I don't need like a road mic on top of this, which is awesome because I'm very shy when it comes to vlogging in public. So now it's just very like Let's come incognito. walk over here and talk and see how the the ISO, oh wait, don't get hit. Let's see how, the, let's see how the ISO adjusts to the picture. Okay, let's see here. So we're stepping in the sunlight. How's it tracking us? It's still oh, tracking. It's still legit and nothing is blown out. I mean, yeah. our faces are a little under. You can see the blue sky. Yeah, that's legit. Yeah, well, this camera is awesome. Well done, Panasonic. Yeah, Panasonic. I love this. All right, back to the hotel room. We go, got some, got some coffee, an extra shot, of course. And we have our second round of tacos. The glazed pork belly. So amazing. So amazing. So we got round two of tacos. Still in round one of drinks, but we're gonna take it from here. So food good. is food is definitely the priority right now. Yeah, way better than the last place we tried. So here we go. filming this on a Lumix G100, which is so convenient and compact. And I'm having my assistant, Daniel Ziegler, help me film this. But my hand is right here, so I couldn't hold it and get this far distance. But I like to have both hands. And now we have tacos. But well, we're doing some moonshine tasting today. Oh, those came out a lot earlier than expected. They did, they did. They're three Koreans. Thank Good you very much. Go. Thank you. Yeah. 
Yes. All right, guys, we are at Six and Body. We're at the moonshine tasting this car with COVID. They don't do the moonshine tasting anymore, which is why I really want to come here. I'm a chain smoking whiskey drinking son of a bitch. If you want to roll with us, you got to do it like this. But they do have moonshine flights. And that still makes my heart so happy. Now it's not like the Kentucky real backyard moonshine we had, but this is also so good and it's fun flavors. So it comes with four already chosen flavors, and then I got to pick two. So we have apple pie, sun beach, sour watermelon, uh, salty caramel, and then I chose pecan mojito, and then strawberry mango margarita, and I'm so excited. And then we got some tacos, which we had tacos this whole entire trip. We had seven tacos yesterday for lunch and dinner. And yeah, so let's do some moonshine. But whenever we go places, they always have like beer flights and cider flights. So Daniel always gets beer flights, and I don't like beer. So now I finally feel like I'm fitting in because there's moonshine flights, and that's my cup of tea. So let's taste some moonshine. I'm excited. So finally, it's 11 a.m., and we're doing moonshine. Only in Nashville. Which one do I start with? Um, what are they again? Apple pie, some beet, salty caramel, tikka mojito, sour watermelon, mango, strawberry I'd probably, mango margarita. I'd start with the darkest one first. Salty caramel? Yeah. Alright, here it goes. Salty caramel. Well, it tastes like alcohol. <laughs> I was gonna say, it didn't even phase you. <laughs> At first, and then when it went down, then it, then it phased me. All right, next up, we have Sun Beach, which smells amazing. So, let me get this one down. That one's good, it does not taste like alcohol. It tastes like a vacation on the beach. I'm a huge fan. All right, guys. Last one, this one's Pico Mojito. I was down to do another flight of Moonshine. Daniel was not. But here we go, Pico Mojito. That was good. That was really good, actually. That might be my favorite one. Unfortunately, it's our last day in Nashville, and we're getting ready for our last dinner out on the town. We're gonna try Emmy Squared, which is a place that was on our list last year when we came to Nashville. So it has like pizza and burgers. So hopefully it's good. We've had we've had a lot of luck so far. We've had a lot of good food, mainly all tacos actually. What is it? Every single meal we've had tacos. Pretty much. Yeah, every meal in Nashville has been tacos, and they haven't let us down. So that's been good. So we're gonna go to dinner and then probably walk around a little bit. Enjoy our last night and then probably get in bed early because our flight leaves tomorrow at 5.30 a.m. And we still have to return our rental car. So yeah, but off to dinner we go. All right, so what I love about this camera is the S and Q mode, which is time lapse. So, and it's just a quick dial right up top. So I'm going to switch to time lapse mode and we're going to walk to dinner. Let's go. Wow, dinner was amazing. We went to Emmy Squared. Mm -hmm. We are stuffed. I feel like I'm gonna fall forward. We yes, sir and ma'am. We had to go for an after dinner stroll. Yes, we did. We wanted to go for dessert, which I could have forced myself to eat dessert. I can always do that. Mm. But there was nothing in the Gold Chair area. 
regurgitated some of that jalapeno margarita. <laughs> oh yeah, I got a margarita and I made like, I had spicy tequila. Spicy was, jalapeno tequila. It was ridiculously spicy. It was so good. But we got pizza, mm -hmm. chicken parm sandwich, mm -hmm. loaded waffle fries. Mm -hmm. So good. Do I look like a shadow in the background? I, I just look like a floating <laughs> beard back here. Come on. There I am. Oh, there I am. <laughs> I see you guys. Oh my gosh. And girls. It was, Nashville was a blast. Unfortunately, mm -hmm. due to COVID, all the dance floors were closed, which I love dancing, so that's all we did last year in Nashville. <laughs> I got him to dance with me, but... Chicken liver. It was fun regardless. Fun to get out of town. Everything was still safe and keeping distance. Um, but this camera, the Lumix G100, definitely came in clutch. This handle is amazing because I can just record and stop. Great little easily. whippersnapper. And tiny little package. So many capabilities. Photos. Yeah. Shoot. I love it. And I think it does really well with the light and the stabilization when we were mm -hmm. walking. Mm -hmm. But if you're looking for a vlogging camera, I highly recommend this camera. There's so many features. Amen to that. It's capable of video. So capable. <laughs> But yeah, I think I'm going to end the vlog here. Maybe a little bit tomorrow at the airport, but our flight leaves at 5.30 a.m. So I'm not sure how I'm going to get up leave here about 3 a.m. So we'll see. Yeah, we're going to finish packing. I did a little bit earlier, but we're going to pack and then get in bed. and probably Tally whacking, gosh darn it. Going to have to pack. And watch some Netflix. He said he was going to wake up at 2 in the morning and pack. And I was like, oh yeah. no, I'm packing tonight. Do it right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And make sure to check out the Lumix G100 that just released. All right, howdy, ciao. bye. Ciao there, bang bang ciao. Bye. Bye. bye.